Hey guys, it's Steve and Secret Avengers issue 10. Hope you guys are enjoying. How many guys are reading all the comic review or listening yeah, and watching? And this is a really good good uh, run with the Secret Avengers run the mission. Don't get seen, save the world. It's kind of a thought of James Bond. Okay, let's go. Here we go. And without further ado, let's go to the review. The great calling is here. Things are getting pretty nuts so far. The Secret Avengers. The good thing, if you have been reading series from the start, we are only talking 10 issues, so it's not hard to imagine. You have seen a lot of strange things happening. Some would say Modoc working with Mario for S.H.I.E.L.D. would be at the top of the list. The different missions this group of Avengers have gone on have almost been all over the place. New York, China, Argentina, out of freaking space. Now we are seeing how it's all connected. Why did Coulson and Nick Fury Jr. have to battle the Fury out in space? Why was Fury Jr. attacked? Why did an assassin go after Mario Hill? All these events and more are starting to make sense. Alice Scott has been cooking up quite a story and the great things is it's not over yet with most of the other Avengers titles tied into various crossovers or big events. It's been refreshing having a series with a great cast that isn't dependent on the others. We have had a bit of comedy. Some have said perhaps too much along with plenty of action and suspense. It's great watching all the pieces start to fall into place. Michael Walsh continues to astound me month after month. These days it feels like it's not overly common for an artist to produce art for a title month after month without interpretation interruption. He has a great style that makes the characters feel natural. Check out his spider women for example. That That is a really cool thing about this artist and everything and this story is kind of different. While it's showing a place where this side and this side jungle and helicopter Deadpool and Hawkeye over there and over there. This kind of things. Shield helicarrier Iliad. We are moving scene to scene quite often, but it's a different storyline that makes a difference between the normal Avengers things and the Secret Avengers things. But in this case, it's sometimes the artwork feels a little bit of a little bit of downtown for me. Downtown? What should I say? Um, not up to my expectation, but in some cases, it's pretty good with the theme. Yeah, I have to admit the theme sometimes. Artists are maintained according to one theme. Okay, so bad things about this one with the revelation of how some of the events here have been connected. The story jumps around a title that is little. We are saying all the different characters scattered about and how everything is starting to line up. This gives the issue a slight jarring feel and almost like there isn't a lot of action happening. Despite some of the reveals shown, we are still waiting on more answers but that's just another reason to come back for the next issue. The verdict is Sacred Avengers is my favorite Avengers title. Yeah. This is said by Comic Vine, that reviewer, but for me, it's not, but it's one of the favorite. That's been pretty cool. There's been some wacky situations from the different missions and Alice Scott is now showing how they're connected. That's that's kind of a true thing that I, I mo in whole comics, I really like this scene. While they're jumping from this machine, from these carriers and doing entering for this mission. That is that is the main thing and that is a pretty cool and in this case is this proves that the artwork is not so much important sometime while the story is really great yes this time it's whole the uh, average artwork is descripting total things the unfortunate thing is it gives this issue a jumping around feel Michael Walsh art remains consistently super he captures the different characters with ease and always mixes up the perspective and panel layouts to keep the issue fresh if you haven't been reading this series do yourself a favor and pick up and the back issues and trade the fact that Secret Avengers is so good should not be a secret because here is the thing when both of them Hawkeye and this 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 guy the gun yes I don't know his name what is his name what is his name I can't remember because I didn't read the last of this issue so here we go 
and this time this action is quite different and here we go there's the character set the Avengers kind of thing so hope you guys have enjoyed it and maybe I have screwed up on the last portion of this review but you can read the comics and if you enjoyed it go to the store and buy the book it's really worth reading sometimes it's not worth but it, this time it's worth thanks for watching bye